Hi, Habibi here. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to help our friend here. I have this message. It is not a message. It is a screenshot uh, sent by somebody uh, that has a problem to show how to show uh, text here. Uh, previously, I had a tutorial about how to create a login and register a feature in unity and php and he applied uh, my method for login and registration and uh, this guy uh, after let's say somebody entered the username and password and click login and he got a response from server for example this response login success now, this guy that asked me doesn't have any idea how to show this login success message here in this user interface and also he has no idea how he can redi redirect the user after a successful login to a dashboard page for example so here in this video i'm going to help him and uh, here is what i can do for example here, here is an empty screen empty scene i'm going to create a ui text this is a text user interface uh, it is here let me scale it up I set its position to the center of the scene and I will increase the size of the text 20 or 30 and I place the text at the center alignment like this and I'm going to create a simple script text detection okay and I'm going to create a button just a, sim just a simple button like this and I will attach this script here let me edit the script I will create a simple method here public void show text and here I will type debug dot lock this is a text and I will call this method when I click this button so here inside the on click uh, on click event I drag and drop the canvas and text detection I choose show text let me run the scene here check out this console and I will click this button you see we got this text this is a text this text came from this line debug.log this is a text so according to the question how to bring this text message here on the screen or user interface what we can do is to create uh, a public text variable here public text text uh, my text this my text is a text variable don't forget to use unity engine dot ui here to be able uh, for you to be able to use the text uh, class okay so my text will appear here in your script inside uh, this canvas 
check it out here you have my text here you need to drag and drop your text object here on the scene here now you have reference of this text object then you copy this uh, my text variable then here after showing the text on the console by calling debug.log we can type my text dot text equals to just copy this text just uh, on UI now let me get back to unity and uh, hit the play button I will click the play button and I will uh, click this button and you will see this text will be changed you see that that is how to show a text message on uh, on the user interface like this now for the next question about uh, to answer the next question about how to redirect users after he is logged in how to redirect them to dashboard for example the answer is if you know how to open scene in unity so the answer is very clear to open another scene let me create another scene here let me just create some scene i call it dashboard dashboard and here allow me to add it to my build, build scenes build settings and this one i double click it and add this one too then here i will i will add a text to show you that this is a dashboard page just like this okay here what I can do here is to call the change scene here after showing that showing that text to open another scene in unity you can call first you need to add unity engine dot as scene management then after you have this unity engine dot scene management you can use this method to open another scene scene manager load scene async i prefer scene async load scene async you have load scenes only and you you also have load scene async this one is better in my opinion okay here we enter a string parameter this string is the scene name of that scene that we want to open in this case dashboard so I will type dashboard here dashboard now I'm going to hit the play button again this time I expect after clicking the button I can see the text is changed and I also will be I will also uh, redire redirected to this dashboard scene okay let me click it here is our dashboard page okay and uh, yeah that's all uh, I can do something here to show you that the text is changed and I will add some delay so I you can see the the how the text is changed and 
after some seconds for example two seconds or three seconds the scene will be changed to dashboard scene to do so we need something called uh, coroutine coroutine is a uh, is some method in unity special method and we can use it as a some kind of timer in unity so to create a coroutine uh, method or function we type i enumerator we type the method name for example change change scene and here inside this block we type return yield uh, yield return new wait for seconds inside this uh, bracket inside this uh, what do you call parentheses yeah here in we need to type the amount of seconds we, we we want to wait for example three seconds f means float so you can just type three or you can add f sign here then we move this scene manager dot load scene async here Okay, so how to call this I enumerator method, we need to call start coroutine, and inside it we paste the method name here like this. Let me go back to our Unity and click the play button. let's click the button and see the text is being changed and after three seconds we will be redirected to dashboard page okay that's all thank you thank you for asking me a question and uh, fortunately i can answer and make a video but if i cannot make a video i just say so i'm sorry okay that's all for this video thank you and see you next time. Bye-bye.